Hey everyone, my name is Sean Cecil from the Oculus Institute, and today we're going to talk about the importance of learning. So I have a friend named Mike Dillard, and he once said that if he, if he looks back on his career, there are only two things that ever made a major difference to him. The first was learning something new, and the second was meeting new people. Those were the two things that made any kind of meaningful jump to his career. And so uh, today we're going to talk about learning, and tomorrow we're going to talk about meeting new people. But one thing I feel that our society has lost is a love of learning, right? There's kind of this expectation that, you know, you learn through high school and university, and then now you're done. And maybe you do the occasional continuing education or, or professional development thing, but it's, it's, it's not something that's a core part of life. It's something that you do every year or two or three or whatever you go learn a little bit and then you go back to work, right? And like, that's kind of the dynamic. Whereas I view life from the perspective of constant, constant learning. I, you know, I, I, I like to say I read on average, you know, about a book a week and have been for several years, right? I listen to podcasts that enrich my knowledge, that help me understand different aspects of life. And I, it, it's a core essence of, of how I operate. And it's a core essence of how most people I know who are excellent at, you know, one thing, much less a variety of things operate is, is this constant learning. And sometimes, you know, I hear people say, oh, well, I don't have time, right? Um, which, you know, I, I would challenge, right? So, I mean, I would say, how many hours of TV do you watch? What are you listening to when you drive? How much time do you spend on social media? all this kind of stuff because if you redirect that into reading into podcasts and other stuff then you're going to gain a lot of valuable knowledge that could you know as mike mentioned ultimately be a, a huge difference in your career you could learn a completely new skill right you because it, and it's not just reading and listening like there's actually applying right you could actually be practicing a new skill you could go and you know create uh something that could be the foundation of a business all of this starts with the ability to learn uh, so that's one aspect where you know just doing that just constantly taking in new information is going to set you above and beyond most people but then if you really want to get efficient at it, this is another thing is people talk about not having time to learn one of the most efficient ways to learn is to go find somebody who's already an expert in something and then pay for a course where they've condensed all of the most effective tools into the easiest to digest, quickest form of information. So then rather than going and watching, you know, 100 hours of YouTube videos and reading 15 books, then you can go get the core stuff where somebody who's already an expert has distilled it and you can ingest that in, you know, 10 or 15 hours, right? And time is money, right? So this is a form of expediting your learning. And so if you do that, if you're, if you're constantly learning from reading, if you're constantly learning from listening, if you're constantly learning from practice, if you're constantly learning by investing in yourself and, and taking courses that give you the information that you need to improve your life, rather than wasting time struggling with something from some inefficient methodology that doesn't work, you know, you, you have what's needed to actually succeed and overcome that challenge and move to the next one, then you're going to create a life for yourself that not only is at a higher stable state, but that always has some degree of momentum going forwards. And we'll circle back to the meeting new people on next week's video. Hey everyone, I hope you enjoyed this video. If there's something that resonated with you, maybe a new connection that you made or, or some information that shifted your perspective, if you found value here, then I wanna give you one last gift. So I've put together a free diagnostic that I call a checkup with the career doctor. Short list of questions, and as you answer them, it's gonna give you a readout of where you stand on the important metrics of career fulfillment, right? How happy are you with your job and how good a fit is it, right? Financial success, which we all know, and then internal alignment, which is your level of inner peace and the inner resources that you have to bring to creating the life that you want. Additionally, it's also gonna show you which areas you can improve on to, to get those metrics moving in the right direction, as well as how can we at the Oculus Institute help you make progress. So it's totally free, 100%. All you have to do is just go to www.oculusinstitute.com slash purpose quiz, right? Um, no spaces, no dashes, just oculusinstitute.com. That's O-C-U-L-U-S-I-N-S-T-I-T-U-T-E.com slash 
purpose quiz. Um, and you can take it totally for free. Uh, you'll get a free report sent to you. And then at the end, it will give you some next steps of what you can do to reach out so that we can help you create the career of your dreams.